Just a few years ago, a fusion-powered fighter jet sounded like something Tony Stark would doodle on a napkin. Now, the US has actually built one, and it's so advanced, even the laws of physics are filing complaints. With a mind-blowing 172 million percent efficiency, this thing makes your fuel-guzzling car look like a campfire. It can fly non-stop for days, which is great, unless it's coming your way. So here's the billion-dollar question. Are we ready for jets that never stop, never land, and never ask for gas money? From dream to dominance. For decades, scientists from the United States and Russia have been racing to bring fusion energy into the skies. While Russia continues to wrestle with the complex physics, America through companies like Lockheed Martin has made a significant breakthrough. Their compact fusion reactor is small enough to fit into an aircraft as nimble as the F-16 Fighting Falcon. This technological leap has drawn in major investors, including Google, Chevron, and the U.S. Air Force, who collectively see this as the foundation of a $40 trillion fusion energy industry. The appeal is easy to understand. Fusion is not just clean and efficient, it's millions of times more potent than fossil fuels. For the military, that means fighter jets that could traverse the globe without stopping to refuel, eliminating the need for bulky fuel tanks or vulnerable mid-air refueling systems. What is fusion and why is it revolutionary? Fusion is the process that powers the sun. It involves merging two lightweight atomic nuclei into a heavier one, releasing vast amounts of energy in the process. It's essentially the opposite of fission, the process used in nuclear power plants and warships, which splits atoms to produce energy. While fission powers aircraft carriers like the United States ship Gerald R. Ford, it carries serious risks. A crash involving a fission-powered aircraft could trigger a catastrophic radioactive spill. Fusion, on the other hand, is inherently safer. It doesn't involve dangerous radioactive fuel or produce the same level of long-term nuclear waste. In other words, it's cleaner, safer, and far more sustainable. Lockheed Martin's Breakthrough in 2014, Lockheed Martin's Skunk Works Division, a shadowy branch responsible for many of America's top secret aviation projects, filed a patent that would later shake the aerospace world. By 2018, it was approved. The design included superconducting materials to create magnetic fields strong enough to contain ultra-hot plasma reaching temperatures hotter than the center of the sun. This innovation made it possible to shrink what was once thought to be a building-sized fusion reactor into something that fits inside a fighter jet. Earlier fusion systems could only capture a small portion, around 5%, of the plasma's energy before becoming unstable. But Lockheed's revolutionary design claims to reach a 100% beta limit, meaning all the energy produced is usable, an achievement previously thought impossible. The compact reactor the reactor itself could operate continuously for an entire year on just 25 pounds of fuel and generate 100 megawatts of power enough to light up 100,000 homes. For disaster zones, remote military outposts, or forward operating bases, this kind of energy source could be a lifeline. But let's be honest, this isn't about lighting homes, it's about empowering weapons. The real purpose is to extend the operational capabilities of fighter jets to a level never seen before. Jets powered by this system wouldn't need to refuel for days. The only real limit would be the human body in the cockpit. Reimagining Jet Propulsion To understand the revolution, one must grasp how jet engines work today. Traditional engines draw in air, compress it, mix it with jet fuel, ignite it, and expel the resulting gases to produce thrust. This process heats the air to around 1,100 degrees Fahrenheit 1,300 degrees Fahrenheit. With fusion, that combustion chamber could be replaced with a fusion heat exchanger. There would be no need for traditional fuel, just compressed air heated via fusion. The result? Silent, sustained thrust that lasts as long as the reactor keeps running. The F-16 Fighting Falcon 2.0 no aircraft is more perfectly suited to receive this upgrade than the F-16, originally built as a lightweight air superiority fighter. Used by 26 nations, the F-16 is a proven war machine. 
famous for its agility, reliability, and versatility. It was also the first fighter to use fly-by-wire control systems, making it easier to maneuver and more forgiving in sharp turns. Designed to withstand up to 9G forces, it allowed pilots to push aerial combat to new heights. Equipped with nine external hardpoints, it can carry a mix of missiles, bombs, rockets, and even extra fuel tanks, and sports an internal 20mm Vulcan cannon for close-range dogfights. Its canopy offers a 360 degrees unobstructed view, placing the pilot at the center of a panoramic battlefield. Now imagine this combat-proven aircraft with a fusion-powered engine. It's not just an upgrade, it's a transformation. Revolutionary Cockpit Technology The F-16's cockpit is built for modern warfare. Over time, it's evolved to include night vision capabilities, helmet-mounted display systems, and multi-function LCD screens that provide real-time combat data. With the joint helmet-mounted queuing system, pilots can now target enemies just by looking at them. The Air Force has also invested in 3D audio and noise-canceling upgrades, helping pilots distinguish between multiple communication sources and detect threats through audio cues alone. The Implications of Fusion in Warfare Let's be clear, this is not just about jets. Fusion energy opens up the potential for a whole new generation of weapon systems. Imagine directed energy weapons, hypersonic missiles, or plasma-based defense systems, all powered by compact fusion reactors. Naval ships could become floating power stations. Ground vehicles could operate indefinitely in hostile environments. In fact, the U.S. Navy is already experimenting with plasma illusion technologies which project decoy heat signatures into the sky to mislead incoming missiles. Fusion could make this technology viable on a wide scale. The Russian response. While America races forward, Russia isn't sitting idle. Its response comes in the form of the Burevestnik missile, a nuclear-powered cruise missile first announced by President Putin in 2018. Despite setbacks, explosions, and radiation leaks, Russia insists the missile is real and ready. Described as a subsonic missile with global range, the Burevestnik can allegedly remain airborne indefinitely, loitering over enemy territory like a sword hanging from the sky. However, the program has faced multiple failures. Of the 13 known test attempts, only two were partial successes, and a radiation accident in 2019 killed five scientists and caused international concern. Critics argue that the project may be more propaganda than progress, but its potential cannot be ignored. The arms race heats up. Historically, nuclear propulsion has always carried high risk. The U.S. once experimented with nuclear-powered bombers and missiles during the Cold War, like Project Pluto and the B-36 bomber, but they were abandoned due to the risks of catastrophic accidents. Russia's insistence on developing nuclear-powered weapons revives those fears. If America's fusion jet is the future, then Russia's nuclear missile is the past clawing back toward relevance. The Rise of Unstoppable Machines The most terrifying consequence of this new era is not just in its tech, it's in its relentlessness. Fusion-powered jets could theoretically fly non-stop for weeks, never needing to land, refuel, or disengage. These aircraft would be unstoppable sentinels, always watching, always present. In war, that changes everything. No longer will success depend on logistics or supply chains, it will depend on who controls the sky the longest without rest, without pause, without fuel limits. The world is watching. As the U.S. Air Force prepares to incorporate fusion into its fleet, the implications are global. This is not just an advancement, it's a shift in power. While Russia's experimental missiles raise eyebrows, America's fusion-powered aircraft demand action. This technology promises to revolutionize everything from global defense to disaster relief, but it could also bring unimaginable destruction if misused. If this blew your mind faster than a fusion jet at full throttle, hit that like button before it flies away. Subscribe for more deep dives into the tech shaping tomorrow's battlefield because the future waits for no one. And hey, drop a comment below. Would you trust a jet that never lands?